many of us as we have started to use Schoology are really wishing that we could get Google to work properly for us. So I'm going to show you a couple of ways. Um, this first video is going to show you how to link your Google Drive so that basically your drive is housed within Schoology. You can create new items, new files um, in your Google Drive, and you can also get embed links and we can assign to students. So let's go ahead and link that Google Drive account as this first um, tutorial. So I'm going to click on resources up in the top menu bar of Schoology, after which it's going to open up into my home folder in Schoology, my resources, and then I'm going to choose the last option called apps. So we have delivered the app for Google Drive um, to all of your accounts here in District 303. And the thing that you must do is you must connect that school account. So I'm going to go ahead and log into my D303 email. So there it is. I'm going to connect that. We're going to try it again. There we go. We're going to allow. And it's being a little quirky on me because I do have two school accounts that are connected with two of my emails. So let's fingers crossed, hope that this is okay. So now one thing I do wanna keep in mind, see, edit, create, and delete all of your Google Drive files. So remember how I said it was now housed in here. That also means that you can delete everything in here. So be mindful of that, okay? So we're going to allow that. And then what you'll notice is that your Google Drive now is going to populate. Now, this does not look like your normal Google Drive, even though it says My Drive. I want to explain something really quick. As we know, Google is super awesome about searching. And we also know that Schoology does not own Google and vice versa. So they're not going to run identical um, to Classroom and Google Drive working together. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click up here. I'm going to type in Team Polaris just as a option to show you. Now, if you have a folder with the, the item that you have just searched, see, I have advisors and I also have students. So it has all of my folders listed. OK, and then I can click into any one of these. And I can grab my meeting slideshows if I needed to. Those are all right in here. OK, so if I'm looking for things in my folders, that is how you are going to search for those. OK, so now that I've done the Google Drive, now I'm going to hop over into my next video. I'm going to show you how to do a Google Drive assignment where it makes a copy for every student with a template. Let's take a look.